It is a cold, dark night for tens of thousands of East Texas families who have no electricity to heat their homes. Power has been knocked out to 30% of customers just in Smith County alone. KTK's Ashlyn Anderson spoke with Encore reps this evening about the biggest obstacles they're facing tonight to restore power in this icy weather. Ashlyn, what did they tell you? Casey, they say wintry weather created a domino effect. Ice covered trees continue to fall, taking down power lines with them. Now families with small children are feeling the impact. Smith County businesses and homes are without power, leaving families everywhere waiting in the dark. Are we going to have power? What are we going to do if we don't have power? Where are we going to put the baby? Um, so it's, it's kind of just, you know, hour by hour chaos. <laughs> Utility companies say this heavy layer of ice has taken down trees across East Texas, many falling across power lines and cutting off electricity to customers. So we've got to go out there, remove the tree from the line. If there's any damage to the wire, if it's, you know, if it knocks it down, uh, breaks the wire, breaks a pole, cross arms, then we've got to replace that equipment as well. As trees continue to fall, outage reports continue to flood on core system and families are left waiting in a home that's getting colder every passing hour. What I'm thinking about right now is how we are all going to sleep in the same room and actually get some sleep. Encore has called in extra crews from across the state to help restore power more quickly. Down the Waco area, they didn't get hit as hard, so they sent crews up here. He says if you don't have power to report it, do not assume your neighbors did. If, if your power's out and, and, and it's been out for a while and you need to find shelter, the city and, and other folks will have places, churches will have places. For the time being, the Smith County family, like so many others, are in their living room, just trying to pass the time. We've just been staying close to the fire, playing games, eating in the kitchen, and, uh, you know, just staying in this small room. Praying the power comes on soon, so this icy winter weather can stick it. Encore says some power lines are several miles long and others are shorter. That's why the number of customers affected by one single power line outage varies. In studio, Ashlyn Anderson, K2K News.